Domestic violence is high on the agenda at the Country Women's Association National Conference. The event was launched in Hobart today and will guide the direction of the association over the next three years. For 90 years, their baking and preserves have been a highlight at country shows. And while knitting is on the agenda for a few, the Country Women's Association insists it's so much more. During the fires and the floods, um, CWA was out there and, I know, and you never ever seen it in the media but they were there. 200 delegates are in Hobart for the CWA National Conference. Domestic violence is one of the key topics. The, the problem is who do they speak to? The Federal Minister for the Status of Women used the conference to launch a toolkit aimed at stamping out violence in the home. It was developed with input from women in a number of regional areas. We heard from uh, women that some of the issues in their local community are of course taboo and uh, people are not willingly uh, discussing issues such as domestic and family violence. The CWA welcomes the pack but wants improved access to support services. The fact remains that there are over 33 per cent of people live in rural remote area but the finances and, and the purse is not divided in a way that that 33% of finances supports rural and remote areas. What it is in rural and regional areas is difficult to access services, so this toolkit actually empowers local communities uh, to prevent violence before it happens. Foreign investment in agricultural land and issues around coal seam gas exploration will also be discussed over the four days. And so will membership, with the CWA keen to show it's still relevant in 2012. Tyson Shine, ABC News.